everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm Mori Crossing and today we're going to the wonderful island of Gaia by the lovely Jekka and I'm so so excited to see her island. We featured her in uh, the beach ideas video and her island then was incredible and this is very different. She had a kind of a cottage core like really I guess kind of European style island it was so beautiful and this today is a combination of um, very city core Japanese almost like cyberpunk area with a really impressive skyline that's the bit that I've seen the rest of it I haven't seen so far and then like really rural I think it's like a combination of all the different parts of Japan and I'm super excited to see it Already we're surrounded by things. She did say there might be a bit of item lag, but as you guys know, I love clutter. So I'm always going to be a fan of islands that have a lot of things in them. So and we've got her awesome flag over here. Look at this. Very neon. It looks almost like Tron. I'm not sure if this is a reference to something or if it's just an awesome kind of cyberpunk design. Let's have a quick look at... Oh, she's left us some presents. Oh, so we have a cyber window. Nice. I assume that'll be in the skyline. So that's all that she's got there. Very pretty, very pretty. Okay, let's see what presents we have here. I dressed up in my one of my favorite, like just traditional Japanese outfits. I didn't really go cyberpunk because I don't really know what I have that is very cyberpunk to be honest. I'm not sure which way I want to go. Is that the wedding one? It is! It's the men's wedding one. I love this. I think it looks awesome. Even though it's technically originally for, you know, the husband getting married, but I really like it. I might wear that one. Ooh, so fancy. Ooh. You see, this is why I'm on the plaza, so that I can't drop it. Ooh, Kabuki's umbrella. Oh, a Kabuki umbrella, not Kabuki's umbrella. <laughs> I got this. I got a fan. Okay, so we have a ladder. So I guess we're going to have to go places up with the ladder. I'll need to remember I've got that. Sorry. And some bubble blowers. Bun wig. Wait. Oh, is that? Oh, no, it's not. It's, it's not the one I was thinking of. It's super cute. Okay, I think I'm going to wear this. <laughs> just because it's just so pretty. <laughs> I really like her come off. Yes, this is the look. Definitely the look. Oh, maybe we should. Oh, maybe we should try the Zordi as well. Don't know which ones they are. They're the same ones I was wearing. Oh no, they're the white ones. Very similar. Okay, we're here at the airport, and let's have a look at the map quickly. So we have. Oh, we have three residents. We've got uh, Kibi, uh, Atsu. Uh, fork. Interesting. And then we have Coco, Judy, Bob, Zucker, Kid Cat, Kali, Piper, Filbert, Pico, and Genji. We have some very Japanese villages, but we also have ones that I wouldn't have expected. But let's have a look, see at what she's done with their houses. Okay, so. Oh, we didn't look at the map. Oh, wow. Look at all of this terraforming and like water work. Okay, I'm really excited. I think it's gonna take me a while to get around this island because it looks like it's on several different levels on different parts. So yeah, I don't know which way to go. I think that from what I've briefly seen from the resident services, um, like the cyberpunk stuff is to the right. So do we want to go futuristic uh, or do we want to go more rustic, which I think is to the left. I always go to the left. Let's go rustic to then to city core. Okay, let's go. Wow, look at her entrance. It's so pretty and so vibrant. I love the use of these um, TV screens as sort of like billboard screen. And we've got the festival, um, what's that called? Confetti machine? I think that needs to be used more, especially on like colorful islands. I think it's a really great addition. It just adds another level. Oh, and we've got a little arcade here and a futuristic train station, I think this is. Wow, look at that! I I um, did that for um, platform 
nine and three quarters. This looks so cool and so different. It's amazing how like the same idea looks so different on like each person's island. We've got uh, oh we got like a trash like umbrella that's a trash can. That's awesome. We've a lost item. Oh no. <laughs> okay, let's go straight up here and another lost item. And we've got like oh a newspaper stand, like an old newspaper stand that's like kind of overgrown. Wow, I love it already. <laughs> okay, so we've gone up and then back down again. I'm gonna go from the front back, I think. So we have the museum here and she's done what I've done, which is kept it as a tent, but I'm, I really wish I'd put mine off of the beach. This looks incredible. Does that mean he has some sort of like study area behind? Like that, that's, is that where he lives? Some sort of like greenhouse area? Looks very fancy, Blather's doing very well for himself. Oh, oh, first let's go down here. And we've got this beautiful beach area. Study area by the look of it. It's got his like microscope and like some books. This is so pretty. And I love these with this sort of like temple looking floor. It really feels like he's gone to some sort of, um, well, I guess it is like a, a brand new place. This island is like a brand new adventure for someone looking at all the animals and the plants. Very tropical place. Oh my god, look at this! I love that it continues into this area as well. We've got the, um, is that a stegosaurus? I'm not sure which plant dinosaur that is. We've got another campsite area here. I don't know whether, let's have a look inside. Someone. So glad we came in here. It's like a mini Blathers area. This is awesome. It's such a small space, but I love it. I'm pretty sure that that uh, bookcase is coming out of the top of the tent, but who cares about physics? <laughs> this looks amazing, Jekka. Oh my goodness. Back outside now. We've got the Children's Day carp streamers there. Wow, this is so pretty. <laughs> oh, we've got Coco's house. And what's this behind? What are the sandies? Oh, is it like a Japanese style? Yes, it's like a Japanese style kind of wooden like, back area, like a uh, building behind there. And she's got some donuts or bolinas. Oh my goodness. I love these. Look at these designs. They're so pretty. Clearly Coco is doing some fishing, as well as um, having a neighbor who, like two neighbors that are looking at all of the different, like exploring and recording so many like scientific bits of data and things like that. It's so cool. Okay, and we've got back here and we've got some places for people to sleep. <laughs> if you want to look at the stars, come here. Oh my goodness, this is Pico's house, this is Pico's house. Wow, so much inspo for my island. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with Pico's house, but I feel like her house lends to so many things. Sorry, I'm uh, up the camera. Oh, look at this, it's got the little Ghibli, little mini Totoro baby one. Oh, it's so cute. I love this custom design. I use it on my island too. The person who made it is so, so talented. Wow, I love all the layering of the the pagodas behind and it's all like this a similar kind of red and green vibe I, it's so beautiful check this is incredible and we've oh we've come we've done a full loop there so do we continue back or do we go to the city area on the right i don't know Let's go back. Let's continue in rural Japan instead. Wow! Even like just the walkways are so like meticulously put together. We've got another little Totoro. Uh, uh, this is mini Totoro, I guess. Ooh, what's over here? What is this? Is this a greenhouse? I think it's a greenhouse. Like a Japanese greenhouse. Yes, it is. Of course, it's got the um, like bonsai table here. Oh, but which way do I go? We haven't been left yet. Let's go left first. Oh, is this tea rooms? 
looks like a very like beautiful little traditional tea rooms area. Look at the tiny little palm tree! <laughs> so cute! This is going behind Pico's house. Wow, look at this area! It's just so like... Like a, not a little pocket, what is, what, is it, what is it called like when... A little nook? A cranny, I guess? Oh, and we've got another... Is this a research center? Again? Oh no, it's a... It's a mechanics! <laughs> We've got like the biker gnome and he's he's fixing this like moon ranger. That's hilarious. Oh my god, Chica, that's amazing. I love it. I love it so much. Um, should I be going back here? I'm gonna keep going back here. Let's find the end of this beach. So we've got a little farm back here. Got the bee area. Oh look, Kid Cat's back here at the diner. How did he get... How did she... Sorry. How did she get back so far? I honestly thought Kid Cat um, was the guy when I first saw her, but I'm wrong. I'm sorry. And look at her cute little tip of the blue. Oh, she's so cute. All the cat villages are adorable. But this is awesome. We've got like a pink little diner. Each area is so well themed and like just separated so well, Jekka. I love this. Okay, let's go this way. Oh no, this is... Okay, that's where that is. Let's find our way back to those stairs, I guess. This is so pretty. It's almost tropical. She's like got so many different themes in one island. It's so pretty. Let's go up these stairs. Wow. Whose house is this? Callie, Callie's house. I didn't realize Callie's house was so green. We've got an awesome place to chill back here with some plants. Um, it looks like we've got a viewing platform here. Wow, can we get back there? Ooh, we've got some sparklers. Place to fish. Can we get back there? Oh my god, it's so mysterious. Is that like a temple? Wow, look at the space. I feel like I'm in Indi uh, like Indiana Jones or Tomb Raider or something like that. Somewhere in Cambodia, maybe. This is beautiful. I'd love to go fishing here and just relax in like, the evening. Oh, look at this. Bisco. Oh yeah, it's the little Japanese like biscuits <laughs> advertisement there. And let's see if we can go across this bridge. Oh, well, can we go back? <gasps> So many little alleyways. I swear, Jackie, you just make your island so much... Do you have more space? Have you, like, bribed Nintendo somehow? Wow, look at this little... It's the campsite area back here. It's just so beautiful. How? How? What is that? Oh, is that a bridge? Look, it's a bridge. That's so smart with the... Um... Oh, and little cars down there as well. Um, It's a like a bridge in the sea. That's <laughs> so cool. Such a cool idea for the standees. Ah, and another place to fish. Oh, we can go back here as well. Maybe. Oh, I need to remember I have the uh, ladder. Oh, it's a secret little like Japanese like place to have a picnic. Ah, this is so cool. So, so beautiful. And so many little like, yeah, nooks and crannies. You'll pardon the pun that I've made twice now. Oh wait, do I go down there with- no, I assume I don't go down there with the ladder, right? Ah, oh, this is so pretty. Got dinosaur bone here. Oh, that was no entry. Oops. But you know me, I've always uh, been a rebel. Yeah, yeah, totally. Um. Anyway, <laughs> moving on swiftly from that comment. Ah, oh, look at the secret beach! Oh my god, he, he can't come in! He can't come in. Red's like if banned from this area apparently. Wow, this is, looks so pretty. It's just like an old kind of art market, I guess, with a little um, lighthouse here. I love it when people go down into the secret beach. I just definitely need to remember that when I make my one. On either of my islands, actually. 
Okay, so we have Genji's house. Of course, I'm going to know Genji's house, my baby boy. Oh, look at this. It's like a temple area here as well. Could we, wait, wait, where's this coming from? I guess we'll go that way afterwards. But look at Genji's little farm area with the rice paddies. Uh, making rice and pumpkins. I guess this one's pretty overgrown. I love the use of this, um, I don't remember what this plant is called. It looks like it's sort of like withering, even though it's, I'm sure that's how it's supposed to look, but yeah, for in this context, it looks really withered. Oh, look at, this is so pretty. Another like place where someone's making, <sighs> making a sort of um, greenhouse area, growing some plants. I'm so scared that I'm gonna miss something, honestly. We're gonna have to go back that way later. Look at this! I think this is the main house. Kibi. No, Atsu. Excuse me, Atsu. I'm sorry. Ooh, we're definitely getting into cyberpunk on this side, aren't we? Is it like half and half? Like half the build building. Half the island is cyberpunk? Well, we'll have to find out. We'll have to find out. I'm fairly sure. Oh my god, this is so cool! <laughs> Oh, it looks like a kind of 90s, like, or 80s probably, actually. Like an 80s arcade. It's, oh, what is this wallpaper? Excuse my voice. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, what is this? It's like a party one. Is this from festival or from your birthday? Is this the birthday one? I think it's the birthday flooring because I got that for my birthday recently. This is so cool, Jekka. This is The atmosphere is incredible in here. I love it. I really, really love it, honestly. It does look similar to the Japanese arcades now, but it's not quite that cool looking, if that makes sense. Like, it's not so neon. Ah, oh, yeah, it does say game zone open. Oh, I see, so this is her. Oh, excuse me. That's, let me out. Get off. <laughs> there we go. Um, the, yeah, arcade center. I did. Okay, I'm gonna go this way quickly. Oh my goodness. This is all so cool, Jekka. Oh, sorry, Piper. Sorry. This area looks cool. I wanna see this area. Oh, this is on the other side of Callie's house. Right, okay. So we haven't missed anything that way. Um... Do I want to work from back to front? I guess we'll see. Oh, that is not the way. Oh, and I just broke a flower, no! All right, let's go down here. Well, we've got a strawberry stand. And we've got newspaper and things on the wall. Up, oh, yep, look at this. Right into a cyberpunk area. Oh my God, is this the view? Have I gone the wrong way? <laughs> oh goodness. I think this is supposed to, you're supposed to, yep. This is the insane view. Look at this. Look at this. How amazing is this? Oh my God, this is so cool. Ah, okay, I need to get to a better so spot to like look at it. Maybe, I think I might go to the front. No, maybe it's this one. Oh, I can't go that. Wait, can I? Yes, I can. <laughs> first, okay, first let me look, just look at this actually. Look, we've got like a little island with some houses on it. And we've got like some, an apple and a, yeah, an apple shop. Oh, this is so cool. We've got like some graffiti here. This is all so cool. Uh, sorry, I'm, I'm busy just like marveling at this place. Okay, let's see if we can get up there. I don't know if I'm gonna need a ladder for that. I might do. This is another house that I guess we can enter after I've found that sweet view, which I maybe we do need to use. This is so cool. This is so cool. Okay. I might, or maybe I don't go up then. That's just, oh wait, there's a space here. I see it, I see it, I see it. This is so cool, I've got a Kotatsu outside, we've got this fan, which you definitely need in summer in Japan. <laughs> I've actually got my fan running right now, I really hope it's uh, not audible <laughs> on the audio. But look at this! Oh, it's, it's, just, it's 
This is the coolest. I need something this spectacular. Well, this is insane. And like with the pink sunset and the pink all around, this looks amazing. Ha ha ho, Jekka. Please share your secrets with us. Share them with us now, please. This is absolutely incredible. I love it so, so much. Okay, let's have a look inside this house now. Oh, and it's got like a little basketball area outside. I'm so excited to see what's inside. Oh, this is Bob's. I'm an idiot. I thought that was I thought that was a residence house. Oh, Bob, that's pretty rude of me to come into your house and leave. I'm just embarrassed. I'm very embarrassed. <laughs> Oh my god, I swear I've done that before as well. I thought, th why did I think that was a residence house? <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna leave. We're just gonna pretend that didn't happen, okay guys? You guys, that didn't happen, okay? But I'm gonna be busy just looking at how incredible- Okay, we can't go that way. Oh, this is amazing. But just like going from like the cyberpunk area, is this stuff behind it as well that's cyberpunk? Yeah, maybe we'll go there first. We'll do the whole of this like back area here. This is so cool. But yeah, as I was saying, sorry, we've like had the rural Japan. We've had like a mechanic area with a temple kind of area. And then we've got a more kind of town vibe down this way. I don't know, it's, it's incredible how many things she's put into one island. And we've got, <laughs> look at this poor whale shark in there. Oh, poor guy. And we've got a, another little picnic area. We've got a little dog hanging out on the beach. Oh, we're all the way at the back of the island. I didn't realize we were that close to the back. God, I really get lost on your island, Jekka, honestly. Oh my god, that's hilarious. I've not seen this one. This is custom design of Totoro. That's hilarious. Oh my god, look at his face. I love it. I love it, honestly, love it. We've got another little, like, kind of neighborhood area, I guess, back here. This is amazing. Just, I'm sorry, I'm gonna keep saying it, but this is amazing. Jekka, my goodness. And we've got um, Coco's house here. Wait, didn't we already see Coco's house? Was it someone else's house? No, this is Zucker's house. Forgive me. Of course, because we've got the squid here. <laughs> At least it's not the octopi. I mean, that would just be cannibalism at that point, right? <laughs> Look at all of these little fish area. Oh, this looks so cool with the like rusted, uh, what is this called? Metal? Corrugated metal, right? We've got some potatoes, of course. Got a little fishing area. Let me just go back around a sec. Oh, this is a little fish market as well. I love this music. What is this music? And where is it coming from? Oh, from the jukebox. That's smart, using a jukebox. I don't, I don't know why I didn't think of that as a, a mode of uh, sound, if you will. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, we didn't get out the sparkler. Let's, let's get out. Let's blow some bubbles, actually. <laughs> so cute. Oh, oh my god. I just keep being like, I can't get amazed again, but every time. Look at this little like laundry basket, laundry box. Works so perfectly with these, one of my favorite items, the uh, laundry pole. I think that's what that one's called. There's two, there's like the modern one and the, that older one. I like the DIY one, basically. Oh, oh my god, these beaches. She's caught with so many amazing ideas for the beaches and I'm gonna like skip everything to the left, I guess, but maybe we'll go backwards again. Oh, we've got the um, little garden eels? Garden something eels. Garden eels. <laughs> Cause they all look, when you like swim in the ocean with them, you're like surrounded by them. There's always loads on the ground and when you swim, they like pop their heads back down, but the ones around the edge of you don't. So it's like a constantly moving kind of wave. It's really cool. This is such a cool area. So like another food market. Going into, what is this? Just like a pier area? 
Yes, like a pier area. It's really interesting that she hasn't used the like river mouths. I don't know why I feel so much pressure to make that into a river because it looks really good as a sort of like making this a kind of island area. Just, yeah, that's so cool. And we've got like a little jellyfish design on there, I think. Wow, this is just so cool. And this is nooks. Wait, you could put strawberry? You could put a custom design on the top of that? What? What? <laughs> what? Are you serious? My mind is blown right now. Oh, this is so pretty. So abandoned and so pretty. <laughs> Got some ducks on the water there. Ah! Oh, I'm sorry. I'm freaking out. <laughs> this is amazing. And here is uh, Zucker's friends, unfortunately. <laughs> That's all I think about. Why did they include a dried squid? A dried squid, a dried octopi area, like item in this, this game. I don't understand. And we've got some like dim sum back here. Is that dim sum? Or is that sushi? Hang on, let me zoom in. Okay, we're getting a little bit of lag now. I think it's dim sum. If I'm not very much mistaken. I think this is like a food cart. Dim sum food cart. Maybe two food carts next to each other. Oh, look at the dog. Okay, let's look at the beach before we go back up. Wow, yet another sort of like market area. Oh, it's a restaurant, a restaurant that sells fresh fish. You'd often get that in Japan. If, it's, if they're gonna be selling sushi, most places will have the fish that you're gonna eat like right there. Okay, let's go back. How atmospheric is this? Just the lighting and the placement. Oh, this looks like a place I can get up with. Maladder. Yes, I'm so smart. Oh, we've made it back to the resident services. I haven't even looked at the behind bit of the resident services. This is so cool. We've got the um, air conditioner. Place to sit. Wait, what's this? Bread sparklers. Okay, we should use some sparklers. Still a blue one. Just out of spite. <laughs> oh, I can only face the way it starts. I forgot. I forgot I haven't used these in so long. Not since last summer, I think, maybe. Oh, I love sparklers. It's it's kind of not confusing, but in Japanese, um they I'm sure that they have a specific word for these kind of sparklers, but they refer to like the big fireworks and sparklers, it's the same thing. Um, hanabi? Hanami? Hanabi. My brain. Anyway, they refer to them as the same thing. So like some of my students are like, me and my friends were holding fireworks and lighting fireworks. I was like, I think you mean sparklers. <laughs> oh, this is a house back there. Oh, do we no, I'm going to go on this walk and then we'll, we can always walk back. This is so cool. Oh, look, here she is. <laughs> Kibi. <laughs> the main, like, resident of the island. I assume this is Marshall's house, right? Wait, is Marshall even on this island? I don't think he is. Piper. <laughs> I knew that. I knew that. And we've got someone else's house up here. Whose house is this? Filbert, of course. It's a blue house. Of course it's Filbert. He's got a little farm here. I love that sound actually. I definitely need to remember to use that. I mean, in real life, I wouldn't like that sound, but in the atmosphere of the game, it's perfect. Um, should I, hang on, let me just check out this area before I go back. I guess, oh God, have we seen around the edge of this area? Cause there's so much stuff up there. Oh, Able Sisters, how do I get up there? How? Maybe we'll find it later on. We'll go inside her house first. Uh, this way. Maybe that leads around to it. Maybe. No, because I think that went on a, only on a loop, right? Anything this way? So, oh, so you can get this way? Not there? Wait. Yeah, we've been up there, right? Right? Right. Yeah, that's the... um. Uh, greenhouse over there, right? Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> it looks like a manor house. Wow. 
what's going to be inside? Okay, wow, it is a manor house. Holy shimoli, look how... Look how fast for a start, there's no lag in this house. <laughs> anyway, look at how elegant it is. Wow. Jack, you have a way with like placement inside and out. This is insane. This is insane. <gasps> Ooh, is this, wait, is this, this is a school, right? Why is it so creepy? <laughs> Why is it so creepy, Jekka? What's happening in this school? What are they conditioning them to learn? What's happening? Is it a cult? I don't... It's very beautiful, though. I love the greens and the, like, light browns. And the, with the dark light, it really makes everything kind of flow together and have a more similar colour. Does that make sense? Like, everything really matches really well with low light. It's so pretty. Whoa! Whoa, what is happening? It's definitely a cult. They're making their own, like, space program? There's a... And it's not just a space program. What is this doing in the corner? Witches, what's happening? <laughs> I love this lighting. Look at this, just like one direct light. Is there a light up on the wall? Yeah, this is so pretty. Ah, I can't believe this. This is ridiculous. Jekka, please, please. Oh my goodness, I can't believe this. Okay, one more room on the first floor and then we can look upstairs and downstairs. I can't believe she's got three houses and she's decorated all of them. I know the other ones aren't full, but ah, look at this. Oh, this is definitely, surely the teenager's room of the house. Wait, which bed is this? Do I even have this on either of my islands? Is that like an ironwood bed? I don't think I have that. Wow. <laughs> like so many thousands of hours playing this game and I haven't got that. Anyway, this is so cool. Again, with the low lighting, very atmospheric. I love the, like, almost looks like um, Metropolis, the really old animated, well, it's like, Animated in a certain way film, like a black and white old film, if you haven't seen it, it's really beautiful and incredible for the time period as well. But yeah, it really reminded me of that. It felt felt very edgy, so that's why I thought it was like the teens room. <laughs> Whoa, what is this fancy place? Wow. <laughs> it's very pink. It's very classy. Oh, this is a club. Is this a club? This is a club. Where it's clearly my birthday. Thank you so much, Jacob, for celebrating my birthday. You're the best. <laughs> oh, we can't go back there. I'm not allowed to get to the drinks back there. How rude. <laughs> this is amazing. Okay, let's go see what's in the basement now. Oh my god. This is like a stark contrast to the upstairs. So another like bar area, but this feels a lot more like a... The speakeasy, is that what it's called? It feels very much like a very cool bar. I've actually been to a bar that was very similar to this and I felt very out of place. <laughs> also, I've been in Japan and they serve the best alcoholic ice cream. It was amazing. I had rum raisin and it was just insanely delicious. Yeah, but it looked really like this. This is so cool. This is so, so cool. Thank you, Jekka, for letting me... This is so, so cool. Thank you, Jekka, for letting me come around your island. This is insane. Okay, so I guess we've just got to see if there's anywhere we've missed within the city area. Which would be to our right. We haven't found Abel's yet. As in, we found it. I don't know how to get up to it. Can we get this way? No. This is crazy, though. Look at all of this building. I had to go on happening back there as well. Oh, God. Dinosaur back there. I remember going past that. Okay, so let's go back up onto the second floor and see where it takes us. I don't... Did it just go around a loop or was there another... Oh, it did just go around in a loop. Okay. Okay. I got this. Uh, water. I'll go back down. 
turn to the right. We haven't been behind here. Oh, is it going to be another situation where I have to use my trusty ladder? Oh, look at this little like laundrette area. So cool. I love the her use of color is incredible. Whose house is this? Kit Kat. Wow, Kit Kat is far away from home. All the way at the back of the left. On the left. Ah, uh, did I miss? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Ooh, like a traditional tea house. This is so pretty. Wow. I just want to. Let me just put the ladder away. I just want to sit here and eat this Yule log, <laughs> this matcha Yule log, and drink some tea. And we have Able Sisters with some lovely custom designs back here and some fox masks and another pagoda. This is so cool. Let me just check if there's another place we haven't missed. We've got another little like railway here. <laughs> Let's go back down. Okay, I'm not sure if we went down this street. I think we went parallel. Oh no, yeah, we did. Maybe this is it, right? I mean, this has been an insane journey. This is, I am so speechless. I've seen her Instagram posts and they've always been incredible, but being here is just another thing. It's just another level of incredible. And look at Zucker perfectly just hanging out with us here. If only we could get him to come up here, that'd be awesome. His cute little face! <laughs> so cute, and this is just insane. So I guess I can go straight into my outro from here, can't I really? With little Zucker hanging around in the background, what a cutie. Well, if you haven't already, please go and check out Jekka, because how insanely talented is she? I mean, thank you so much for letting me tour your island, it was incredible. Um, the details for her Instagram are down below and the DA will be there and everything like that. Oh look at Saka, he's so cute! Anyway, if you want to see more things like this, I have a playlist of all my island tours. I've done a bunch from a bunch of amazingly talented people. Go check those out as well. And if you want to see more content from me, why not subscribe? And liking this video really does help me out, all that jazz. Finally, if you want to become a member, you get a bunch of perks. And if you click the join button, you can see all those perks and all that kind of thing. It really helps support the channel. And a big thank you to all my tea leaves. I love you guys so, so much. Here are my golden VIP tea leaves. I guess I'll see you in the next video, guys. I don't want to leave. I just don't want to leave. This is so pretty.